seems I've got half a year left, at most. Hey, what happened? The hell are you doing? Oh shit, we got a leak! Not too long ago, I was working in a temporary waste storage facility for decommissioned reactors. The forklift driver had a sudden heart attack. One accident led to another. You got a death wish? Forget the rest and get out ASAP! The drums weren't filled with much. Contaminated dirt. Worn out components. Protective suits. As far as radioactive waste goes, it was low risk. Low enough for no immediate harm, as far as experts were concerned. In light of that, there is no certainty it was the cause. The cancer could have come from just about anywhere. Hold up. What were you doing in a friggin' reactor? This is nuts. This is how I chose to make amends. Leaving my old life behind meant living in the shadows for good. Every time I stepped into the light, the people I loved got hurt. It had to stop. Trouble is, there's not a lot you can do in the dark. Not a lot of good, anyway. So, this was your answer to all that? Yeah. This was something I chose. Hardest part was convincing that I doji to let me do it. <sighs> and this is much bigger than me. Right now, that reactor's full of people willing to step up and do the work that needs to be done. All I wanted was to play a part however I could. Otherwise, I probably would have wasted away into nothing by now. That's about the smartest thing I could think of. You know, being educated on the streets and all. Uh, you sure there's not some mistake? All you've got is half a year? Yeah. The last thing I wanted was to make a big deal out of it. But then I figured it wouldn't be right if I kept this from you guys. I don't know. You seem like you're in good shape to me. <laughs> well, I can still haul ass when need be. <clears throat> that said, I need to pick my battles wisely for my health. Uh so, is that why back at Akane's, you weren't exactly spoiling for a fight with Yamai? Yeah. <laughs> Though, I am a bit hurt. <laughs> you really think I'd pick a random fight that easy? This shit's unreal. 
hear you, son. Of all people. Man, you don't have time to be out here wrecking yourself like this! What you need right now is a doctor! Believe me, I've gone. Apparently the cancer spread. Metastasized, they called it. Nothing any surgery can fix. They gave me some pills to ease things, but that's it. Still, if you're sick, then you need to be getting your rest. You said it's the Daidoji faction calling the shots here? Well, I've got some words for them. Kasuga. No, I'll make this right! Kasuga, it's not like that. <sighs> my being here and everything, that was my decision from the start. If it helps, I'm not just following orders. And don't feel like you dragged me into this either. But then, why? I just don't think retirement's in the cards for me. Sure, maybe I could stop and settle down. But I'd rather put what time I've got left to work. Work? Doing what? Running around on the government's leash? Instead of that, how about you stop running away from reality? <sighs> Think I'm gonna hit the shower. <laughs> when I'm out, we'll rock, paper, scissors. See who gets the floor. Is he for real? Hey, Kaska, you okay? Yeah. I know the guy's basically a superhero or whatever, but that's just crazy. I mean, he's got cancer. Once he's out of the shower, let's try to convince him to go to the hospital again. There's a pretty big one here in town. No, it, no one would be enough to stop him now. Huh? Cure you, son. He had the same look in his eyes as Arakawa-san. See you tomorrow, Ichi. I see now. They're the same. He had already made up his mind, too. What, 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 what do you mean? Who did? Uh, actually, it's kind of hard to explain. Anyhow, if that's how Kiryu-san wants it, then there's only one thing we can do. We get this taken care of quick as possible, then get him to a hospital. Man, I just don't get you guys. Think about it. If you up and die, it's all over. All right, let's get moved. What? Are you still up? No, I'm not upset. Still, it... I just didn't want you guys to worry. Sorry. Guess I only made you more concerned. Well, I mean, how could we not be? But cure you, son. Hmm? Seriously, thanks for telling us. If I didn't know and something happened to you, I would have never been able to forgive myself. To be honest, I'd rather drop everything and take you to the hospital straight away. That said, I know how stubborn you are. So, for my sake, do you think you can rely on us a little more? Rely on you? I'm not about to treat you like you're on your deathbed, but we're here too, you know? So, share the load. We got your back. This way, you won't push yourself too hard and we'll stay happy. Right? Right. Mm, I see. All right. Yeah, I'll try to do that. For what it's worth, your help means a lot. Both of you. <laughs> Just doing what we can.
Yeah? Death right. Enough chit chat. Where to? Good question. We still have a bit of no telling what we'll be up against. Make sure you're ready. Tomizawa. They're a good place to go shopping. Hmm. How about the Anaconda Shopping Center? Close to District 5, and they got pretty much everything. Cool. Stock up there first. What's up? <sighs> I see. Thanks. Yeah. Hmm. Now that Are you 
This is the garage the bartender told us about, huh? Hey, what do you want? Huh? Yeah, I'm over here. Uh -huh. Whoa! Customers, what seems to be wrong with the vehicle? Oh, uh, actually, I'm here about my baseball bat. Well, there's your problem. That's not a car. Yeah, I realize that, uh, but... Wait, hold on! Revolve's bartender sent us. He said there's a one-of-a-kind mechanic here. Hmm. Ugh, why didn't you say that up front? I wasted a- Oh, so am I in the right place? If the bartender sent you, yes. We can offer a selection of non-vehicular maintenance services. Name's Julie. I'm Ichiban Kasuga. Nice to meet you. Ugh. So, shall I- Please. Wow! Guy your age still walks around with a skullcracker like this? That's old school. In a cringy kind of... Thanks. You can help, then? I'm used to modding guns, swords. <laughs> a bad is child's play by comparison. <sighs> oh well, let's get on with it. What were you... What is it now? What if I tried... Huh! Shut up! I'm thinking! A little more... This is even better. Good! Holy... It's been... I got bored halfway through fixing it up, so I made some better leverage here. It'll be a much deadlier instrument now. Yeah! I'm satisfied! I'm so so much easier to handle. You're a miracle worker. No wonder the... Uh, that was nothing special. What'd you say? Nothing. You heard nothing. Hey, Missy. I'm helping someone else right now, but the exit door is free to assist you. Don't test me, honey. I'm not going anywhere. As I've already told you, we only work on vehicles here. Come back when you need an oil change. Enough bullshit. Everybody knows this is a weapon shop. Quit. Even if this were the place you think it is, I reserve the right to refuse service to whomever I so choose. Fuck you, Brad. This how you want to play it? <gasps> now give me some goddamn service, girl. Hey, you need to calm down. Hell, who are you? Just a customer. She's replacing my alternator. Settle down and I'm sure she'll be with you, fucking tourist. <laughs> All right. How about I shoot you? Then I won't be well, damn, that does sound reasonable. Let's try it. <laughs> You're a dead man. Someone can The battle is on. Yeah. Ah, 
Here we go. Ready as I'll ever be. Okay. Here I come. Got it. Don't let it go. This is goodbye. Ow. Cool. This shop's off limits to you from now on. Got it. Sorry, you won't see me again. You okay? <sighs> Happens sometimes. Word gets around. The kind of men who look for trouble are good at. Still, I can usually turn them away without much difficulty. Appreciate you taking the bullet for me, though. Oh, uh, sure. I guess with skills like yours, a lot of guys would be interested in coming here. Mm hmm. But my rule is only people the bartender gives the okay to. Oh. You and the bartender go back long? No, not very long, but... Well, a lot's happened. I'm renting the space from him, actually. He's technically... Is that right? He owns more than Revolve Bar, then, huh? Anyway, if it isn't clear, I'd like to keep our weapons work under wraps. I expect your discretion. Well, I suppose if the bartender trusts you, I should too. Yeah, of course. All right, if I come around again? Sure, you were useful today. I'll help you out. Only thing is, next time I'll have to charge, and you'll need to supply your own materials. If that's fine by you, come again anytime. Oh, one more thing. Over in the Anaconda Center, there's a colleague of mine. I'll let them know you're allowed there too. Got it, thanks a lot. Looking forward to seeing you again, Julie Chan. Julie... Chan? Oh, sorry, force of habit. Does that sound strange? No, no, I get it, it's a Japanese thing. I've just never heard that applied to me. I'm kind of flattered, honestly. Yeah, well, just let me know if it's weird. No, don't worry. It's cool. Julie Chan, it is then. <laughs> You're a funny guy. I'm so. Mm. Welcome. What is it now? I'll start right now. What if I tried... Ha! Shut up! I'm thinking. A little more... This is even better. Good! That should be much better.
Welcome. What is it now? Meet your expectations? What if I tried... Ha! Huh, shut up! I'm thinking! A little more... This is even better. Well worth your time. I'm back again! Welcome! What is it now? Back again. Too easy. You messing with us? Let's do it! 